hello everyone and welcome to the channel in this video we will see record trigger flow in salesforce with action and related records in previous video we have seen record trigger flow with fast field update and in this video we will see record trigger flow action and related records so we know what is record trigger flow the record trigger flow is automated process that execute automatically on record creation update or deletion usually we use an apex trigger to achieve this task but now we can also use the flows so what is the optimize the flow for there is two option available in the flow one is the fast field updates and second one is the action and related records so in previous example we have used fast field updates which means when we update the fields for a same object so in previous example we have created a flow for fast field updates in that example we have seen when the opportunity amount is greater than 10k the opportunity state should be automatically converted to the closed one that means we have updated the same field from same object now we will see how to use action and related record option so there is scenario while working as a salesforce admin i was assigned a task whenever the active field is changed from yes to no basically active field is a custom field and that field change from s yes to no all the opportunity of that particular account that are in the open stage should be changed to the close lost so without any delay let's jump to the org this is my home page let's navigate to the flow here i am clicking on quick find box search here flows here you can see under the process automation we have a flows option click on it we are going to create new flow here you can see new flow option click on it and we are using record trigger flow for updation deletion and created record click on it and then click on a create button now as per our scenario whenever the active field change from s yes to no for that the record may be already created and we only change that field from s yes to no that means whenever the record is updated very first we need to select object here is a triggering object of account then configure the trigger here we need to select a record is updated click on it then scroll down we need to set entry criteria for that select all condition are met and here we need to define when the flow should trigger the flow should trigger when the active field equals to no because whenever we change active field from s to no then the flow should trigger and then here you can see when to run the flow for update records we have option every time a record is updated and meet the condition requirements and only when the record is updated to meet the condition requirements for that here select second option and then we are using action and related records because we are updating opportunity record from the account updation then simply click close button because this change automatically saved here you can see our start condition now we have triggering condition when active field is changed now we need to update the opportunity record for that here you can see plus icon for add element click on it and select update record here you can see under the data element we have update record component click on it enter the label here as per our scenario we are going to update the stage when from the account active field is change then click on api name it will automatically populate then here how to find records to update and set their values we are updating only one field for that here you can see specify condition to identify records and set the fields individually click on it and here we need to select on which object we are going to make this updation here we are going to select opportunity record click on it and then filter opportunity record here we need to filter records to meet the update conditions that means let's say uh, there is a record which already have the opportunity stage closed one then how can we change that record for that we need to for that we need to apply filter opportunity record here very first we need to declare that the opportunity we are going to update is related for which account here as you click you will see the all the opportunity fields because we have selected the opportunity object here you can see account id we are going to relate this opportunity to the parent account 
for that select opportunity id equals and here and here to relate this account id to the parent account this record is a global variable when we select the triggering object that object will available for global record click on record account and then here we need to select id you can search for id here is id click on it then we need to add two more conditions here i am going to add conditions and here the account stage sorry the opportunity stage the stage name the api name is stage name it does not equal to closed one and one more condition the opportunity stage also does not equal close lost after that we are ready to set values for opportunity records here we need to select the stage name and which stage name we have to apply when the active field is changed from s yes to no here we need to select close lost because as per our scenario when the active field is changed from s yes to no that means that account will not active further for that the stage name will be close lost now we have done all of things simply click on close button review this flow here we have added condition when active field change from s yes to no then the flow will trigger and here we have updated the opportunity stage name now save this flow the flow api name automatically populate enter the description is good practice because whenever uh, another person will uh, see this flow they should know uh, for uh, which purpose this flow have created i am not go going to add description simply click on save button then before the active this flow always debug because this is the good practice i am clicking on debug button then so select any account i am selecting first one and then click on run here we are getting error to resolve this error we need to see is there any related opportunities available for this account or in the debug details we also have another error that this error occurred field custom validation exception that means we have validation rule applied on opportunity object we need to deactivate we need to deactivate that uh, validation rule for that go to the setup navigate to the opportunity object scroll down you can see validation rule and here we have active validation rule click on it edit and then deactivate this validation rule click on save now we need to see is there any related opportunity for this uh, account okay we have uh, one opportunity now we are ready to debug this flow i am clicking on debug again option select no and then click on run here you can see the debugging is completed now we will see how the flow works for that click on activate button now you can activate this flow and then go to the account object for that i am selecting the account of india first you need to see is there any opportunity yes we have there is a burlington textiles which stage is qualification search for active field here you can see we have active field with s option we are changing to no and then simply click on save button as we click on a save again go to the related records opportunities and here you can see the burling textiles opportunity is converted to the close lost this is how we can use the record trigger flow with action and related records if you like the video hit the like button subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon to get regular updates thank you